Yo, what is good everybody? Welcome back to another Call of Duty mobile video. So as you guys know, we did a video about the new update and with the new update there is the brand new gold rush i guess promo as we would call them not exactly sure so in today's video we're going to give you guys the fastest way you guys can unlock the m4 lmg the moonstone is the m4 lmg lmg right chat we're just going to confirm that exactly the m4 lmg as you guys see i'm at 974 and you might think like hitman you've been streaming all night however i only started grinding this about like what i want to say like 4 a.m in the morning and this is 6 a.m so it literally took me two hours to grind this and i'm gonna give you guys the best way that you guys can actually unlock this so there's gonna be two methods it's either you play with teams or you play solo and i'll give you guys basically the loadout you should be rocking as well as how much point on average you can expect so um i'll show you guys some clips real quick of me actually getting up to 100 points Oh no. All right, perfect. I got the 100 point. But then we're going to show you guys um, regular clips. We're actually going to play a game because we're actually live on stream right now. And if you haven't yet, join me live on stream, The Hitman Live. Put it down below in the first pinned comment. Solo one's super simple. Basically, all you want to do is just run solo and literally get all the kills you can without confirming it. That's basically the main thing you want to do. You don't want to confirm it, but you want to try to get as much kills as you can. But you also want to confirm it as much as you can by matching them. It's kind of hard to explain, but you guys will see in the game. But what you really, really want to do in solo is just try to rush as much as you can, and that will help a lot. And also another cool thing about this, you have to kind of note that if you have the skin, the outlaw skin, I don't have it on this account, but if you have the Outlaw Dust Biter or Dust Kicker skin, you get a 50% bonus. So instead of getting 100, you get 150. Instead of getting 75, you get like, uh, what, 105, so on and so forth. So basically, when you're doing this right here, you want to do it with your friends because it becomes more beneficial as a group. Uh, in solos, this is what I would rock as a uh, loadout. I would go with, if you're trying to drop a nuke at the same time, I would go with the Vulture, the Lightweight, and the dead silent i've actually tested which score streak you should use which we'll talk about in a second because people might consider going stalker if you're pre not stalker sorry persistent and also going with a VTOL. if you can actually manage to hit your shots then you don't even need to persist it but if you're bot like me you're gonna need persistent so you can get the veto and you can get up to 40 kills but the way i do is just run around get kills you'll be able to get 40 points 50 points super easily so instead of actually getting it in about what 40 games you can get it close to 20 games it's not stock, all right? So the cool thing about getting the vulture is that you can actually get nukes. Rem remember that you don't actually drop guns when you die. So when a bot drops a gun or a player drops a gun, you can't pick up any guns. So you have to have vulture. If you're trying to go for like long kills or try to get veto, because if you're trying to go with the veto, you have to have the vulture just to get the bullet so that you're able, unless you're sniping, you can snipe. But that's if you're going swimming. If you're going team, this is what I'm going. Basically, you're going to go against real players. You want to go with the cold-blooded so that that way you don't die to either stealth chopper or the um what's it called the rc car and the main thing about this is you don't want to con what's it called confirm the kills you just want to go for kills i think in one game the whole team had probably around 200 kills total and that's more than the amount you would get if you were doing it alone so if you're doing it alone and you're solo capping the most you can get is 80 points 40 40 but if you're doing this your team can get more points you can get more points so i've actually got 100 so that's pretty insane so we're going to jump into a game right now and you guys will see more or less what we're doing and how the gameplay goes. All right. So I actually only need like 25 points, but I'm going to try my best to get to like 40, 50 points this game. If you get to 50 points, it's really, really good. And like I mentioned on this class, it depends on what you see on players. Like if it looks like bots or not. So this doesn't really look like bots. You know, look at the names, Mr. Cool Ice, Gangzo, Dora, Dylan. They're just kind of names that don't look like bots. So I'm going to go with my real loadout, try to get some kills. Um, I forgot to talk about the score streaks, but we'll talk about it afterwards at the end of the video. But I'm rocking right now the lowest score streaks that I think is good. I don't have Molotov. I put the Hunter Killer Drone because the Hunter Killer Drone can get you about five kills a game, which is really huge. I've tested Goliath. I've tested um, the, the Vito. I find you get way more kills just from running around and killing people. So hopefully I can slide in here and get like a few double kills. Yep, got those two kills there. So it's 0-0, zero, zero. you don't have to capture the points, but if, you, if you're if you like trying to get the score streaks... So you want your team to also do well, it's not just about you. Lost only. Potatoes? Gosh dang, that was some pretty bad potatoes. And you kind of want to get your score streaks going. So you guys see it's 0-2 right now, so you want to head, boom, get those points back. So that we can actually match them. So we're not actually really pushing the game too long. There's going to be a guy coming out this way, we're going to get him out this way. There's some... Just a, just to match their point total, you know? 
So right here, you see that we get our UAV. We're gonna get our hunter's killer drone as well, and as our shock RC. So back. I've already got eight kills right now. I want to reload this real quick. There we go. And then you kind of want to match. You see, it's five four right now. It's it's okay if you're going a little over because you're you're gonna accidentally get some sometimes. Sometimes you're gonna accidentally kill someone and be next to it and then I'm using the annihilator because you can shoot people from far and you don't accidentally pick up the tags hunter kill drone could pick up a kill here which it, we got a double kill here we'll get another kill here it looks like maybe I could have dropped a nuke on these guys oh I ran out of bullets maybe not so now we're gonna use the annihilator so I got 14 points already pretty pretty crazy oh I'm actually using the death site actually on this one I'm using the annihilator on the other one the death site is actually something I wanted to test but the, the death site seems to be not bad because it gives you extra bullets. I should be able to kill this guy here. Get a few kills there. Just get a nice amount of kills here. Just get that guy there. I was thinking about the gravity spikes. The gravity spikes, the problem with the gravity spikes is that you accidentally actually get the people there. Nice. We got a bunch of kills there. The scythe is really nice. I use the scythe or the death, ma uh, the death machine or the... Um... Is there a guy here? Oh, oh, he's not dead. Oh my god. See, like, he accidentally confirmed kills here. We already got 25 ki 25 points right now, which is pretty crazy. With the scythe, you can just keep going, rotating through the scythe. And it, the only downside is to have all these um, operator skills is that you're. Oh, bro. I'm running out of bullets. Oh, bro. Yeah. Let's try to get as much kills as we got. We already got 28. We're only at 14. And it works really well if you have teammates who understand what to do. Obviously, if you're doing solo, you try to rush as much as you can. Oh, my God. We just got a triple kill there. That's pretty sick. Yeah, we just got that clear. You don't, you don't really want to act, get the kill confirmed, but if you accidentally do it, it's fine. I'd rather get the guy who's not looking at me first so that at least I can get that kill. Easy kill, RC car. We should get our scythe pretty soon. See, like, we're not losing right now, which is perfect. We don't need to actually have to worry about collecting. It's gonna be enemies behind? Just chase after these people. You might accidentally actually confirm some kills. I'm out of bullets. Ah, shotgun. We get RC again. I'm gonna get the scythe really soon. I got 37 kills already, right now. So I'm already on pace to, to already get the 40 that I was looking towards. Obviously, if you play against like super hard sweats, it becomes really annoying. But right now, you're most likely not gonna be playing against super hard sweats. Let's see if we can get some kills here. Gosh, this guy just running around. Can get a few kills here. Can be a guy up there somewhere. I didn't mean to confirm that. There's gonna be people behind here. Dang. All right. We have 47 points. Still plenty of time. We have like more than half. We're actually on pace to get 100. Nice. Nice. Shoot. Nice, nice. Throw this bad boy right here. Get that nice kill there. Get an assist there. Accidentally pick that up there. This guy with a shotgun trying to be a freak. Some big guy right here, I see him. You gotta get shocked by our teammate. As you guys see, yeah, so still, still like 13 more kills. Still plenty amount of points. We got a double kill there with the Yeah, we got so much kills from this. Bro, that head glitch is kinda nasty, not gonna lie, chat. 12 more points. We got so many points right now. Getting a bunch of kills. Basically, you wanna try to slay out. Obviously, I feel like some people would be like, hey man, what if we're not good at slaying out? I'm not good at slaying out and I'm able to get all these kills, right? So Bro, that guy shot me from on top. 57, we're thinking on pace for like 75 right now. You guys see, we're getting a bunch of points right now. I'm probably gonna get the scythe soon. I 
Shotgun, shotgun guys, shot. annoying. Hunter killer drone at least. Friendly hunter killer drone deployed. The enemy is jamming our radar. UAV online. Friendly shot. Kinda wanna get rid coming. of their Friendly shock RC has been destroyed. Yeah, we died there, it's fine. We're gonna bring out the side, get a few kills from that. Bring out squad. Bring out I had the wrong gun out. I I'm at the prick's site. We got kills after kills here. No! The shotgun free got me. Yeah, we gotta not try not to kill confirm. Yeah, we gotta accidentally not kill confirm here. That's where it becomes kind of annoying. We only need two more. No! Uh, but we got 68. Yeah. And obviously, if you can extend it for longer, you'll get way more. But as you guys saw, I got 68 in one game. So basically, that's pretty insane. I Like I said, the average is about 40 to 50 per game, depending on how well the opponent plays. Uh, let's just claim it. Bang. There we go. What a beaut. Ladies and gentlemen, what a beautiful, beautiful gun right here. And we got it. It looks way nicer than a chicken. You know what I'm saying? The iron sight is dookie, okay? It's it takes out so much, but the skin itself, it looks it looks decent. The skin itself looks pretty good. All right, we'll see if I, if these are real people. Yeah, there's a, there's a sniper there. We'll, 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 we'll just test out if there's any gun animation. That's one kill there. There's there's a bunch of snipers. All right. I love kill house, so can I wall bang that? Be a guy here. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna show you guys the rest of this gameplay because I don't think I'll be able to, to drop a high amount of kills on this. So that's gonna be it for today. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video, and hopefully, this will help you guys grind this skin super duper fast because I was able to get this in about what two three hours. I want to say three hours, probably maybe like we'll say like three and a half because I played a little bit before, but didn't really. We didn't do this method. I actually tested tested this a lot on stream just to make sure we can get that. So that was great. If you guys want to see my latest video, right side of the screen. If you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe. I've been posting daily and we'll be doing that for at least a month. All right, I'm out.